Well, 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 serious. 2-2, two, two. obviously call it champagne. Man's Jamaica. Really cool. Baines, Shaw or Cole? Well, I'm definitely not sure about Luke. I think he's very, very overpriced. This is the reason why England don't progress, because 18 year olds that have done absolutely nothing on the world stage or the European stage get a 30 million price tag, bare peas, don't know what to do with it, end up spending it on girls from Playboy, don't even like them. Shaw seems like a guy, got a little bit of banter, a little bit about him. I just don't understand how he's worth 30 million. Absolutely ridiculous. Just. It's just so dumb. Then Leighton Baines, bruv, he's never played Champions League football. I don't know if he's even played European football. He's clearly not good enough for the world stage. It was exposed in the World Cup, overhyped in England, goes to the world stage, doesn't do anything. Ashley Cole has won Champions Leagues. Ashley Cole's won leagues. He's won FA Cups. He's won, he's won League Cups. He's got so much about his game, got so much experience. Why he didn't go to the World Cup is somewhat beyond me. I can understand that Roy Hodgson's trying to blood in the young players from now, and that's good. I understand that. But you have to go to the World Cup, at least get out of the group stage. You have to play players that are going to get you out of at least the group stage. And Ashley Cole's a man that, like I said, he's been there before. Okay, he was put on his bum by Rivaldo or Ronaldinho in 2002. But he's got so much experience at that level. Mm -hmm. To not bring in makes no sense, regardless of the games. Because the flipping goalkeeper for Brazil has played two games all season. So I don't even want to hear about a lack of game time and so on and so forth. It's not, he's, you're asking for 